Hello everybody. Got a little project going on today. You can see the sun's coming in the door. I took the tarp down off the off the big cage. And uh, these guys are now five weeks old. I've got a project going on out out back. And I will show you that in just a second. So bear with me. And with the magic of video, we are now looking at what I've been working on to get the the quail outside. And that's going to be done tomorrow. What I did is I took my two big long cages and I will put the males on one side and the females with a couple of males over on this side. The excess males will end up being the ones that go to freezer camp. So what I've done is I put a tarp over the top so if it rains or if we happen to get a little night snow or whatever, it uh, they still can be undercover. But I've covered up, covered up the back side. And all I have to do is unstrap the, the tarp and put them in and out and feed them and water them out here. I just wanted to show you what I had done. It took me a while today. The weather's nice. I've had a couple other projects going on. And uh, Ruthie slipped and fell, so she sprained her wrist. So I've been taking care of her this morning. And uh, icing her wrist. So I didn't get a chance to finish up what I was going to do. I was going to get them all in here today, but didn't happen to work out that way but I wanted to show you what we're doing this week like I said it was week five and we're gonna get them outside where see this end they can lay I'll have the feed in this end and the water in this end and they can lay in the Sun and if they want to get back out into the shade away from the Sun they they can go in to the back part. Now each side I have a it's separated down this these are two separate cages if you I don't know if you can see back there but in the back part there's a, a door opening and you can get into the other side where it's dark. the wind isn't going to get to them and they can stay out of the wind at night. It's this is what I always called my the quail's summer home. I've raised quail out in this before. Last year we had rabbits in it. We're not gonna do the rabbits this year. But excuse me I'm trying to get around here. Alright but this is just a little to show you what I've been working on all day. I need to get them out of the garage and get them, get them out here where they can get some sunshine and fatten them up and get them ready to start laying eggs. Because being week five, I've only got about a week and a half to two weeks that they'll be starting to lay eggs. Then we can start collecting eggs to eat and then the about week eight we'll be able to collect some for re-incubating for more winter winter feed all right i just wanted to show you what i've been doing this is clay from popel's backyard farm and i hope you enjoyed this and uh comment below and if you got any questions and we'll see you next time and don't forget big or small you too can be a backyard farm Bye-bye.